Weather can be dangerous for anyone who works outside or is exposed to the sun. Two Works for You reporter Jitzel Puente is live from Jinx with the dangers of being in the heat. Jitzel? Brian, my photographer who's behind the camera, Dennis Meister and I have been drinking a lot of water, trying to stay hydrated today and trying to find shade whenever possible when we're working outside. Now, some people around this area are also taking precautions, especially those doing physical labor. Really hot, really, really hot. Roque Avalos from Tulsa has a job to do no matter how hot and humid it is outside. This week I worked 12 hours. He's been working 12 hour days since last week's storm, picking up debris. I removed uh, like a half trailer last Friday. Just a few blocks down, we met up with custom painting workers who were also battling this heat. Towards the end of the day, it gets pretty rough. Um, you just want to go hide in the shade somewhere. Charles Cook knows how serious it can be not taking the right steps to stay cool. Yeah, I've been caught in the heat and I'm diabetic, so it makes it even worse. Dizziness and nauseous and uh, blurred vision. The state medical examiner will determine whether extreme heat caused a broken arrow man his life last night. Police say someone found the 60 year old unresponsive in front of a house where neighbors say he was doing yard work. Health experts caution, stay hydrated, wear light-colored clothing, and find shade if you'll be out in the sun. I just drink water from the time I get up to the time I go to sleep. Drink a lot of water. Experts say it's important to drink water before, during, and after any physical activity. Reporting in Jenks, Jutsal Puente, Torx for you.